Youth Month 2024 will be launched on Friday at Constitution Park ahead of a packed month of activities scheduled for various locations around the island. Director of Youth Development Rohan Lubo is appealing to the general public to come out and support the youth of St. Lucia as they celebrate Youth Month. We are in the month of April where we celebrate our youth and I would like to encourage everyone to come out and support us. On Friday, the 5th of April, we will be launching at Constitution Park from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. And it coincides with the homecoming of Julian Alfred. I would like everyone to support her as she celebrates her achievements with us. We will be having a number of activities island-wide this year in the month of April. We have been in collaboration with the Youth Economy, National Youth Council, Rice and Lucia. And I could safely say that you are in for a packed month full of activities. So come out and please support our youth. Meanwhile, Youth Development and Sports Minister, the Honorable Kenson Casimir, is optimistic that the policies of the St. Lucia government will continue to enhance the development of the nation's youth. So I'm certainly looking forward to um, Youth Month this year. I think as a ministry, um, we've been working on a youth policy for a number of years now, and I think we are going to definitely have that launched in the month of April in celebration of our young people. Uh, we've been negotiating and putting together Skill 758 app as well, a very important application for young people to really expose themselves to St. Lucia, the region and the world in terms of what skills and talents they have in, term, in, in, in search of employment. And so we're looking to launch that app this month as well. And of course the customary youth, um, youth parliament and uh, activities throughout the communities and constituencies, I think uh, we're looking forward to continuing to celebrate our young people. St. Lucia have shown that in the region they really stand tall. Recently in the Caribbean Youth Awards, St. Lucia was able to cop at least four awards, which showed that the rest of the region respect the youth development thrust in St. Lucia. And we're only hoping for more and better in the coming year. Among the highlights for the month will be the Island-wide Skills 758 App Roadshow, scheduled for April 13 and 14, and a youth retreat at the Babino Multipurpose Center on April 27. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.